COP28, the largest conference on record, attracted 84,000 attendees with prominent billboards promoting wind energy, climate ambition and ExxonMobil's carbon capture projects in Dubai. In nearly three decades of COPs, global oil demand, emissions and temperatures have marched steadily upward. But the United Nations and bakers of the COP process say the planet would be in a much worse place without the gathering. Countries have adopted a strategy of announcing voluntary pledges and initiatives at the start of modern COPs, meant to drive up enthusiasm and ambitions and start things up on positive tone as delegation green through two weeks of tough negotiations. In the first five days of the summit, dozens of voluntary partnerships were launched or expanded and at least 37 new financial pledges were made, according to the Global Strategy Communication Council, which is tracking the promises.